starting my move-in vlog. If you're new here, my name is Emma and I go to the University of Oregon and I'm about to be a sophomore and I'm living in apartments this year. So I'm going to be showing you my move-in process for all of that. Um, it is currently the day before move-in day and I need to pack my stuff. Tomorrow I move midday, I think after 12 was when I can move in. Unfortunately, tonight I close at work, so I need to like get everything done like now so that I for sure like have my stuff together by tonight so I can like go move all my stuff tomorrow without having to worry about last minute packing stuff. So basically I have like everything packed except for my clothes and like any other toiletries and whatnot. Um, I guess I'll just show you what I have packed so far. So if you watched my apartment haul, then you would have seen most of this stuff. This is the messy, ugly version of it. But basically, I just have all these boxes and bins, which I know it looks like a ton of stuff, but my sister is moving in with me, so there are two people's worth of moving stuff right here. Anyway, so I think right now I'm just gonna start packing up my clothes because really the main thing I need to get done. Oh, before I really get into that, let me explain like what I'm doing for move-in. So my apartment's like official move-in day is on the 15th of September, which is tomorrow. And then the first day of classes start on the 24th of September. So since the University of Oregon is in Eugene, Oregon, and I live in Portland, Oregon, they're only like an hour and 45 minutes apart, I am going to go down for the day and then come back so I can work a couple more days before I go to school. Tomorrow I'm bringing all my stuff and then I just have a couple days that I need to have like some clothes, some of the stuff that I'm not packing, but it can't be too much stuff because I don't want to have to like have two different giant move-in days. But yeah, so basically what I'm going to be doing right now is separating my clothes between what I'm bringing like to school tomorrow for sure and then what I'm going to like bring later. So yeah, let's just do that. I don't even know. Okay, so basically Sarah and I still share a closet and this stuff here is all hers and this is all mine. That's why I'm not touching that half. I'll just close it. Okay, I just got all my hanging clothes down that I'm bringing, but I still have all these drawers and my shoes to go through, so I might do that pretty quickly. Okay, so I just put all my shoes into this giant Urban Outfitters bag. They fit perfectly, so that's good. Um, I just decided I'm gonna keep all these shoes at home. I'm just gonna start going through my drawers, figure out what I can keep and what I can send home. Okay, just went through all my drawers and got everything out that I am going to be bringing. Bras, underwear, socks, um, sweatpants, workout clothes, shorts. Oh my god, I didn't even think about the fact that I have all my like sweatshirts and jackets and dresses, so I'm gonna grab that stuff right now. <laughs> okay, I've got all my coats and sweatshirts and dresses in this pile. like a good handful of shirts, get a small piece of twine and tie the top together and then I'll put them in a trash bag and I'll just fast forward that because that's not interesting. Okay, just finished packing all my clothes. One thing I did just remember though is I still need to pack my jewelry, so I think I'm gonna do that really quickly. So I'm also gonna pack like all my makeup stuff and just leave behind the stuff that I know I'm gonna need, like for work and whatnot, so I guess I'm doing that too. Okay, 
Okay, got all that packed. I feel like I'm done for now, honestly. I'll figure something else out that I need to pack, then I'll resume this video. But as for now, there's literally nothing I can think of, so. Okay, it's apartment move-in day, so. Oh, I'm out of breath. I just got ready. It's currently like 8.15, and we're about to start loading up my dad's car. Okay, we absolutely stuffed the car full of stuff. Um, yeah, maybe we do have a lot of stuff. Yeah, you have a lot of stuff. <laughs> okay, we officially moved everything into the car, and I'm just making myself some eggs before I leave. And before we actually go to Eugene, we have to stop and drop off our car. Um, weird thing happened. I guess there was a recall on our car that we're like bringing to college. So the programming was like messed up somehow in some of the cars, like the same model I have, where it doesn't allow the car to go past 37 miles per hour. So like they're making us come in and like make sure that our programming's right. So that's where we're gonna head after. Oh, we're bringing our taquitos so we can eat them for our lunch. So oh, we just finished eating and whatnot, and we're about to head to the Toyota place so they can fix my freaking car. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it right now. They just want to make sure there will be nothing wrong with it. So we got to Eugene. Um, we're waiting to pee though, so we still can't move in yet. So we just checked in and got into our apartment. Um, it's empty right now. I'll show you my room right now while they do that in our bathroom. So they're so tiny and I did not realize how tiny they were from online, but like that is my room. For some reason it smells like food in here. Like it smells like tacos in our apartment. Um, then there's mine and Sarah's bathroom. Fun. Shower. Whatever. Yeah, Sarah's bedroom is like in the corner. It definitely doesn't seem like they make the prior residents like clean out. I don't know if you can see right here, but they're literally like fingerprints, which that's weird. And the floors seem like they're kind of dirty. So I'm not sure what that's about, but I'm gonna move my bed. So. I'm actually like stuck. Can you down on what to do? This after is such that. a shit show. Did it. This table is literally oh, yeah. dirty. All right. I'm so confused. Whatever, there's some good natural light. We're about to start like moving stuff in, so. All right, so that's like our front door, and then when you first come in, there's the closet with the laundry room. This does not close. <laughs> okay, we just finished moving everything in. I don't see anything. My mom's loading our dishes in there before we like use them. We have some stuff sitting in here. And I'll show you my room because that's where all my stuff is right now. Um, now is a little time lapse slash montage of me unpacking everything. One thing I'm super happy about actually is on the website, I think some rooms are more updated. At least their stage room looks a little different and they have gray walls and I was kind of upset about that but now I'm seeing they are white, so I am very happy about that because I don't like gray walls. They're really depressing in the winter time and you know, with like seasonal depression, being an organ, that does not help. Okay, I just finished my bedding and it makes it look so much better in here. Okay, I think I'm gonna pack a couple more things so that corner looks a little more tidy. Okay, got that area set up. I'm gonna figure out my shoes right now because I have this little over the door thingy. So I'm gonna start putting my clothes in the drawer. He's hanging up my mirror. 
and I think I'm gonna put my firefly lights around this. Okay, I've made a lot of progress since I last updated. I had my dad start hanging my gallery wall, which I honestly could have done, but I'm too short. <laughs> I do need to hang a couple more pictures on it. They just didn't have a hook, so I'm gonna have to figure that one out. Um, these three things here were initially supposed to go into it, but I decided that it looked fine with just this stuff here, and I wanted to put it on this wall since it's kind of empty. I put the mirror up, put my firefly lights from my dorm room around it, just put my carpet out because, I don't know, it looked ugly, so I decided to make my room look good. Yeah, here's just a quick little overview. Oh, I also put the rest of my clothes into those bins. So, yeah, I still have a full empty drawer down here. And then in my closet, it looks like this right now. I have a ton of storage. So, yeah, that's for, that was in my dorm room last year. It's convenient, and I kept everything in it, so I'm just popping it in there. That has a couple more pairs of shoes. Oh, and also put my shoe thing on the back of my door here. And I got that for my bathroom to hang my towels on, but... It doesn't fit over the bathroom door, so that's where my backpack is going. Hopefully you can see me trying to balance it. I'm about to put these up. Got my hammer and my Ikea nails. Okay, I did it. I think it's uneven. But honestly, I don't care. <laughs> oh, I also had these in my dorm room last year. I just put them up there and I put the rest in the bathroom. So basically, all that needs to happen now is I need to put those lights around my room up here. And then I need to figure out a way to hang these in here. Um, so I just put our pots and pans here. bathroom floor is a lot bigger than we thought so we actually have to get a new um floor mat thing okay i am eating lunch right now because i haven't eaten since this morning and it's been a while so Unloading the dishes finally. Oh my goodness. Okay, it's been a while. We went to Target and I didn't vlog in there just because we were getting mostly cleaning supplies. Um, my mom actually just vacuumed our rooms for us because it was so dirty. Like, I don't know. I heard someone else complain about how dirty their room was and like people were having to like call the maids here to have them clean it because it just did not get cleaned here before. And I feel like that sounds really like prissy and like spoiled, but like were paying for an apartment and I don't know like they didn't even bother to make sure it like looked good for the new residents to come in like it's not like I'm getting this for free or something so I am like basically done finished the gallery wall over here wall decor is good except the very last thing I wanted to get done was lights so I'll just do a fast motion of me doing that because I got command strips at Target so I'm just gonna hang all these up and go around and do my lights really quick officially done decorating my room. Okay, I think I might make this like a two-part vlog, so I'm just gonna end like my first move-in day here. Um, I am going home now though, and I'm going to like fully, fully like move in on the 20th, so yeah, bye room for now. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video, but definitely stay tuned for the next move-in video because I'll probably make a second part to it. Um, yeah. Subscribe, and if you go to the University of Oregon, comment down below.